uh, here in this slide i'll briefly explain the gemini virus life cycle once the gemini virus is injected by the white fly into the cytoplasm of the cell the dna has to enter the nucleus after uncoating once the virus particle virus dna is uncoated it enters the dna of, uh, nucleus of the cell after entering the nucleus the complementary strand is synthesized first by the primer synthesis followed by the complementary strand synthesis once the double stranded dna is formed it is bidirectionally transcribed and these transcripts then enters the cytoplasm of the cell for the translation and once the proteins are translated they enter the nucleus again and participate in the process of replication packaging and movement of this viral dna here you can see the protein in red color that is bound to the origin of replication of this dna this is called the rep protein and once rep protein bound to the origin mix the origin of replication the replication process occurs it is the rolling circle mode of replication and once the replication is complete rep protein bound to the next strand again religates and then the new molecule of dna is released and this released dna then participates in this cycle of events till the viral dna reaches a threshold once the threshold is reached the proteins either coat protein movement protein come and coat it then the coated dna is ready for the movement to the next cell or transmission for by the white fly